Hello, y'all. We're gonna make some protein waffles. I've never made, like, I don't, I'm not a recipe follower girl. I'll tell you that much for free, but we're gonna just try to m follow a recipe today and make some protein waffles and see if they taste good. Yeah. Also, if you're like, this is da daily vlog number 15. Two weeks we've been doing this for. So if you're wondering why I'm doing daily vlogs, it's because my mom lives in Ecuador and I'm hoping that if somehow I do daily vlogs for like enough years on end, I'll be able to move her back home and buy us a house. Anyway, <laughs> welcome to Tism Pump YouTube, y'all, where we discuss my experiences with autism, mental health, addiction recovery, and becoming a baby bodybuilder. I'ma keep winning, winning. I'ma keep winning, winning. I'ma keep winning, winning. You can try to save your stomach, but you only go play your stomach. You can try to save your stomach, but you only go play your stomach. You can try to save your stomach, but you only go play your stomach. You can try to save your stomach. Today we're gonna make some friggin' protein waffles, and I don't like recipes. But that's okay. We're gonna follow a recipe anyway. And for this recipe, I got a package from Beyond Yourself. And we're gonna be using the protein that I just got, cookie dough protein. And I've never used or tried Beyond Yourself protein yet. So I'm very excited. The only other protein really that I've used and liked has been my protein protein. So, so if we're gonna just unbox this, this is what we're using today. It's um, isolate cookie dough ice cream protein in all her glory, Miss Girl from Beyond Yourself. And then we also, just for the purpose of unboxing, we got this. It's preset pre-workout strawberry kiwi. I'm gonna try this, not today though, because today is my rest day. And then we also got some keto ice, so basically it has like L-carnitine in it. And some other things to stack with my pre, one set. I'm wearing granny underwear, like period underwear with tight shorts. And it's just not the vibe, it's not the move, but that's okay. Also, I didn't have a waffle maker, so what did I do? I went on Amazon, because I'm a prime member, baby girl. Remember, never forget. Um, and I got an uh, Elite Gourmet Mini Waffle Maker. It was the cheapest one they had. I think it was like 14 doll hairs. So we're gonna unbox her together, babe. But when I got it, the, when this showed up on my door and I was like, that's tiny girl, she's a tiny girl. So. I was surprised, I was like, she's so small. Cook real food, homemade with love, slay. Okay, I don't know why, for some reason, like the box was the size of the box, right? I should have assumed it was gonna be around this big, but like never in my dreams, and I know the size of waffles, you know? And never in my dreams did I assume that something would be this small. How cute is this, a baby? Okay. Well, <laughs> bro. <laughs> okay. Well, and I don't even really like waffles that much. Here's the thing. Maddie, you guys know Maddie. If you don't, her and I did a vlog together. We went to, ow, fuck. We went to um, Monster Gym together. She goes to my gym. She was telling me about these waffles she was eating and I was like, I went and got gluten-free waffles and I was like, oh, these are good. And I've never been like a waffle pancake girl, but I tried it and I was like, mm, this is good. Here's what we're gonna need to make this. So, um, in the recipe, one sec. Okay, so here's what we need for this girl. We're gonna need some cinnamon. Um, for me, we're gonna have some gluten-free oats, and we, we're gonna blend these. It's gonna be a whole fucking mission. This kitchen is about to be messy as shit. Egg whites. And maybe we'll throw an egg in there. 
Um, and then some Greek yogurt and protein powder. Um, she also said unsweetened applesauce, but she said that you could take the applesauce and switch it out for a banana. So that's what we're gonna do. Cause I'm not a fan of applesauce, girl. I'm just not into it and that's okay. Honestly though, looking at recipes makes me wanna fucking vomit. Like, I don't know what it is, but I just really don't fuck with recipes. I'm just not into it for some strange reason. I don't know it's, if it's like a rule following thing, but whenever I see it, my eyes just glaze over. So, oh my God, I literally don't even, I didn't even get this open and it already smells so good. Oh my God. Okay. What I like about Beyond Yourself is that they're third party tested. So like what's actually fucking in their supplements is what's actually in there. If I could get it open though, that would be phenomenal, bitch. Yep. Okay. And it's gluten free and I need gluten free girl or my stomach's going to be upset. Whoa. <laughs> Put my face too far in there. That smells good. Oof. Okay. The fact that I have to follow a fucking recipe is really fucking with my head and I don't want to do it, but we're going to do it for the plot, for the YouTube. And to begin this, I guess, okay, it's simple, right? Here's what it is. Those are, this is the, this is the recipe, if you will. 35 grams of rolled oats blended into an oat flour. One scoop of vanilla protein, 30 grams. 50 grams of unsweetened applesauce. 80 grams of plain Greek yogurt. Oh, what? Egg whites, it doesn't say how much egg whites. I'm stupid. Well, we're just gonna fuck it we ball as we do most things and it doesn't say how much banana. So again, I'm just gonna fuck it we ball this, honestly. I am hilarious. I'm hilarious because I assume that I don't have any more of something because object permanence is a problem for people with ADHD. So if I don't see something, I just assume that I don't have it. And then, ah! This is chaotic as fuck. And then I, then I go buy like more of it, right? So I thought I didn't have any chickpea protein pasta. Just down there in the depths of my kitchen, I count three boxes. Like, make it make sense. Oh, it feels like my vagina is being ripped to shreds. And then we should probably clean this Miss Girl because she's been not cleaned yet. Fuck, I'm dumb as shit, eh? Okay, well, let's clean her. Also in true ADHD form, what do we see here? The fridge is open. When is it not open is actually my question because it's never not. I don't even have a sponge. I'm literally just putting soap on this and hoping that something happens that's the right thing. Also probably not supposed to submerge this in water. I'm just breaking all the rules, but you know what? When I lived in Mexico, I had a panini press and guess what? I submerged that fucker in water constantly and absolutely nothing bad happened, bitch. Maybe my bread was a little bit more hydrated. No, I just had to drain it like this. It was so funny. Clean enough. Good enough, I think. It's fine. We're gonna plug this bad boy in and we're gonna let her heat up, I guess. And that's another thing too. I will never read directions. For what, for why do I need directions? Absolutely not, bitch. It's plugged in, so something may happen. We're gonna just, I should read the directions, but I don't want to, so I will not. Okay, and 35 grams, I think, of oats. 35 grams of oats. This bag, she's on her last legs, miss girl. I don't even know if there's 35 grams in here. Probably. Oh my God. 47 it is, babe. Because I'm not going to just not use the rest of the thing. And that is my fatal flaw, truly, is I just don't listen. I don't follow instructions. 
And now we must search into the depths of the protein powder to procure the... Yep, there it is. We got it. Should I increase other ingredients now because I increased one? No. We're just gonna... This is why I don't do... I just don't do well with following instructions. I don't know. It's kind of my fatal flaw. But you know what? I've become a phenomenal cook just by trying different shit. So it's all good. And she said to blend this. So we're going to blend this. I don't know how well that's going to go over. But I'm going to cut this part out so your ears don't bleed. Oh, it's not actually even loud. Just wait. Loud! Okay. I mean, she's blended. And that's what happens when you have a fucking Vitamix girl. Okay. That smells like something. Then what we're going to do is we're going to take... Oh! Okay, a banana, and that's, well, that's a banana, for sure. <laughs> and we're just gonna, do you see the consistency of this thing? Okay, well, and it's not an exact science, clearly. <laughs> we blended that, oh yeah, we're supposed to put this in, maybe. A little bit of cinnamon. That's a lot. <laughs> Imagine me on a cooking show, dude. Okay. And it doesn't say how much egg whites, so we're just gonna crack an egg. And then, did you see that? That crack? Yeah. It's because I used to work brunch rush, girl. So I know how to crack a little eggy with one hand. It's one of the only things that I can do. Then we're gonna take Greek yogurt. And honestly, I don't like yogurt, but it's part of the recipe, so, and the thing is, is like Greek yogurt is high in protein, girl, so we're gonna fucking add it in there. It is 80 grams of plain yogurt. The fact that I'm having, about to have yogurt right now is like so insane to me. 85, good enough. Because I really hate yogurt. I think I just had like one too many expired tubes to go from Costco as a child. Oh, and our waffle, uh, waffle iron is, she is heated up, Miss Girl. And our egg whites are also very much um, past the due date. Okay, we're gonna mix her. Oh, she's mixing. Okay, Slay. Yeah. See, if we followed this to a T, the approximate macros would be 40 grams of carbs, 4 grams of fat, 43 grams of protein. But again, you know. That's not what we're doing here today, girl, and that's okay. We gotta scoop some off the sides because the powder is... It smells quite good. I don't know. We're gonna find out. I'm not really, as I said, like a waffle girly, but I kind of just wanted to try. I wanted to try some new things, which is hilarious considering for the past... Probably close to 10 days now. I've been having the exact same three meals for every single meal without fail. And I haven't eaten anything else. It's horrible, but I love it. It's a good thing that this is happening because I need to fart. And I will fart and I fear that it will be loud. I just did it. It didn't make any noise. Slay. Like, it is something. I'm not too sure how this is going to go. And then we're going to take spray and we're gonna spray you down an avocado spray moment and we're just gonna she's hot miss girl okay just a little spray and then we're gonna throw this in i guess i feel like i should be showing you close up one sec we're gonna this is gonna be a culinary cinematic experience for you miss girl okay see that Yes. You're welcome. Look at this. It's giving art. Okay. And we're just gonna close this. I don't really know how long this is gonna take or supposed to take. I don't know, whatever, because again, ADHD. That's what she'd be doing, girl. But this probably would make four. Oh, okay. Oh my God, I'm so excited. She's just simmering away. Oh my God. Well, that's cool. Shut the fuck up. Okay, I'm gonna make a few. I'm gonna make all of them. 
and then I'm going to show you what they look like, and then we're going to fucking taste test them. I'll be back in one sec. Um, we have three waffles so far. They feel... I don't know. I don't know about this. I don't really... Like, they're very dense. They smell good. I'm not sure about it, to be honest. I'm also not a waffle girly, so I don't really know what I was expecting here. I was gonna make a bunch and then freeze them. If they're good. I don't know. We'll see. Again, very unsure. But we're just gonna fuck around and find out. And the last one has been made. Ah! She's very hot. And this made like four waffles, girl. Here are the waffles. And we're going to sprinkle a little bit, a little baby bit of cinnamon on there. If I can open it. Okay. That's more than a baby bit. And then I don't really like the wet touching the dry. So we're going to take some of this zero cal maple syrup, baby. I use this like every day in my coffee. And we're going to put this in a little separate bowl. Well, we were, that was the plan. We're going to throw her in here, Ms. Girl. God, this, of all the YouTube videos, I have made the biggest mess creating this one. Right? He's like, yeah, mom, the kitchen's a mess. Okay. And I'm going to eat this with my hands like my Neanderthal brothers and sisters intended because I am, my mom is 3% Neanderthal, so I am at least that. This is very hot. Okay, we're gonna take a cooler one. And this is the kind of like consistency of it. If you can see. Hmm. Okay. Not the fucking syrup on the chin, bitch. Hmm. That's actually really fucking good. It's closer to like a pancake consistency. I think that if I were to make these like I just did now, that's fucking good. Holy shit, bitch. Um, and then put them in the oven. These are fucking good. I wish I'd made tea. Oh my god. Not it just becoming a mukbang. Maddie fucking ate with this recipe, girl. Holy shit. Be so fucking for real. This is so good. This was a success, I would say. 43 grams of protein, 40, 40 carb, maybe a bit more or less because we didn't use applesauce, we used a banana. I would highly recommend making this. I don't follow recipes ever, as I just said, but this has got to easily be the easiest, the messiest, and the best tasting DIY waffles. Um, I'm kind of shocked. Anyway, that was daily vlog number 15, y'all. We just made some fucking protein waffles. Sorry, I'm just in shock. I can't wait to get off the camera so I can eat more of this. Yeah, this was lit. I would highly suggest making this. And um, if you got to the end of this video, thank you so much for watching. This was making protein waffles, I guess. I don't know. If you liked it, slay, comment, like, share, subscribe. If you didn't, I don't know what to tell you. If you fucking hated it, send it to somebody that you also hate despite them. And that's it. YouTube done. Slay.